Welcome to another episode of the marathon life's not a sprint it's a marathon lace up and subscribe today i feel so accomplished it's eight o'clock and we're ready that was my goal this morning i was like we are not gonna be rushed to go to school today and voila ready thomas is ready his lunch is packed i have a half hour till we have to leave so i'm gonna get to work and Feeling really good today. I'm going to meet with the um, staff or whoever's around at the country station and I haven't met them yet, even though I started working there last fall because I work Saturdays and the main office is an hour away. So I'm driving up there once I drop off Thomas today. So I'm really excited because um, I start Sunday and today's Thursday. So I was like, we best meet and remind me how to say the things and what you want me to do and then I'm going to our local office tomorrow to get a refresher as well and my photo taken so didn't wash my hair today just dry shampooed the crap out of it and I'm gonna wear a hat uh yeah I'm just feeling good today slept through the night woke up at 5 15 blessed life I know that seems early to you but to me that's a sleeping compared to yesterday at 2.30. And I was definitely asleep before nine, so I definitely got eight hours last night, same with Thomas. Um, let me just, oh, it was like overexposed. There we go. No, I don't look so exposed. Don't look so exposed. Okay, this work is happening. I will check back with you in a bit. There'll probably be some terrain talks today since I'll be driving for at least two hours. It is such a nice day today. It's currently 14 degrees. It's supposed to be 25. So I'm thrilled to have this like beautiful sunny drive. Do I have my sunglasses somewhere? Yes. Just went to Starbucks. Gotta show you that I went. Yes, I did. To get myself a little treat. And now I'm gonna drive. I downloaded some podcasts and I also downloaded a couple of audiobooks. Uh, I've really been into that lately and I think it's perfect for a drive and just in the car because I get I don't know, I get a little bit restless with music, depending on my mood. So I bought a Z Sensari's book, I think it's called Modern Love, and then I also bought The Great Gatsby, because I've always wanted to read it, and I saw it, and I was like, yeah, it's like five bucks, so I'm gonna listen to one of those, I think, or a podcast. I downloaded some of Oprah's podcasts, and the new Girl Boss podcast with Gwyneth Paltrow. That is finally back with Sophia Amoruso. That used to be my jam when I worked out. So, anywho, so I better uh, get on the road, get going. Don't want to be late. That'll be a great first impression. Also got some almonds, because I'm already hungry. back home now it is 12 30 I had a lovely meeting it was so nice to see everyone and touch base and wrap my mind around coming back on the air I have an on location on Sunday and then I am back Monday morning so yeah I'll be good just eating some almonds that I bought at Starbucks I'm sure they're all in my teeth <clears throat> I wish I had brought lunch and more water but <laughs> Story of my life, story of my life. It was really nice, it was it was really good. And like, talking about the concert, like Miranda Lambert on Saturday got me super excited, and 
was really good. And the day is so beautiful. So I drove here listening to Girl Boss Radio. She was doing an interview with Gwyneth Paltrow. And it was like, I was so happy. It's a beautiful day. There's not a cloud in the sky. All the fall colors are gorgeous. Driving along the lake, sipping my coffee from Starbucks. I was like, this is a good day. Oh, it's just so lovely. So it was nice. It's just nice to, I rarely drive by myself, especially for, you know, an hour or two. Oh, what's happening here? Flashing yellow. That's not good. It's just really good. It is so stunning out today, as you can see. It's already 21 degrees. So I'm just listening to some tunes and just feeling grateful. I figured while we were driving, I would answer a question that I got after I posted a couple of videos this week. Um, because I was talking about how we laid Jeremy to rest last weekend and I got a lot of questions asking me why we waited three and a half months. It was a request of someone in his family to wait. So we did that. In hindsight, I wouldn't have, but you know, at the time I was being respectful and I had no idea, but that's why now I have said to you, if you're ever in this situation, don't wait. But I will say, like, I am progressively feeling more peace and more closure. Um, my therapy helped a lot yesterday. But the actual act of putting him to rest was much more beneficial than I anticipated. Um, so I wanted to share that with you. It really feels like the closing of something, you know, I'm still upset, I'm still grieving, but I don't know, yeah, it felt good, it did feel good, a little bit of peace, a little bit of closure, <laughs> but that was a question I got a lot on those last videos that I posted about it, so I just wanted to mention it here, I went to pick up my Miranda Lambert tickets, and I almost freaked out, because she was like, um, could it be under any other name, no ma'am, it could not be under any other name, but I ordered my tickets through her fan club and you can only pick those up the day of. Phew! Little, it was just a little bit of woo, what? So we'll have to get those on Saturday, but I'm so excited. I'm getting really excited about the show now. I'm feeling really good about it, which is nice. Cause as you know, I was having a hard time with it. So sweaty. <laughs> it's just after four. I don't even remember the last time I updated you. Um, hi. I went and got Thomas from school, had to go pay the funeral home for the burial, and then dropped him off at OSNS, then raced to the bank, because I'm still dealing with legal stuff to do with Jeremy, and then now I'm back home again, and I am just about to edit my vlog. I'm so hungry, so I'm gonna try and have a snack, and then go pick up Thomas from OSNS again. <laughs> just like, boom, 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 I, uh, just one of those days, but it's Thursday, Tomorrow's Friday and there's no school. My mom is taking Thomas all day. I have a couple meetings and I'm meeting with my trainer. So I'm super pumped for that. Yeah, just wanted to update you, but really I just need to get to editing tonight's vlog. That's it. And then I saw a marathoner today at the radio station. It was so funny. She was like, hi, can I see your watch? I was like, yes, you may. Hopefully you entered the giveaway. It was so awesome. She's like, me and my dog were marathoners. I was like, thanks Kat, I appreciate you. Oh, so nice. <laughs> a trusty snack. Hummus and snap peas or any veg that you choose, but this is what we're going with right now while I get ready to edit tonight's video. That looks really like ominous. <laughs> it's so hot, I took my pants off. Joys of working from home. Just working in my t-shirt and slippers. As you do. Can we? focus thank you I am coming downstairs I I know I look I, I know we're just gonna have to move past I really need to wash my hair I am coming downstairs because I have laundry in the dryer I didn't do it today it looks like I have a toupee like I legit could like what what do we think should this be my new look um I didn't do my laundry today I didn't do it yesterday I'm pretty sure I did it Monday. 
and it's been sitting in the dryer since then. Baby steps, baby steps, but I need to put it at least in my room, get it on the top floor instead of the basement. More baby steps. Just in the spare room realizing I should probably show you guys around. Just need to tidy it a titch. It's not quite done. But if you want to see my spare room, let me know and that might give me some incentive to like finish it. See, okay, okay, okay. Let me get my laundry out. I think I may have mentioned this before, but in case I haven't, this is genius. So this, oh, I'm gonna fall over. This mesh bag fits inside my beautiful laundry hamper in my room, but then it comes out so that I don't have to bring the laundry hamper to the basement. Got it from Winners, recommend.